is Andrew also known as Ghost Jr. and today I am opening up, uh, let's see, the Gwen Stacy, the new figure, or <laughs> Spider Gwen basically, but the new figure came out and uh, yeah, let's get to it. Flip the box around, see some other figures in collect, let me just zoom in on that. Picture of Gwen Stacy right there and all the other figures. They do have the other Spider Gwen figure, so I'll make sure to do a little size comparison and differences. Yep, right there. A little Sorry, box. Wasn't planning to keep you. Alright. And there's a figure out of the packaging. As you can see, the colors. Very cool. And then I'll show the accessories. And her accessories come with her mask head. And then one, like, uh, swinging looking hand and one closed fist. Not much to accessories. And it comes with. Forgot her name. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But yeah, it comes with her. It's interesting why they included her. I don't know why they didn't include her just the uh, Spider Man 2099. So it's weird. See little details on her face. Very cool. So nothing much. She's just a little figurine. And then for Spider Gwen, she has a little thing on her arm here. Very cool. Colors are pretty sick on this figure. I'm her uh, timeline colors. Shoes still the same. Her hair, though, is pretty sick. Nice purple with blue. And here's her other version that I have. The one that came up before this new one. It's basically the same figure, just basically different paint. But this one has more of a smile, or like unmasked fit head, and this one's more of a serious one. And here's some um, high comparisons with uh, America Chavez, I think that's her name was. Yeah, that's a, I don't remember. <laughs> uh, but yeah, some high comparisons, pretty good hype, as you can see. And another high comparison with She-Hulk, obviously She-Hulk is going to be a bit bigger. And here's a bit of a uh, high comparison, I couldn't get them stained because the Scarlet Spider kept falling over, but yeah, you can see the different... Obviously, a lot more bigger than Scarlet Spider. Now I'll try getting some, you know, good old articulation in. See, see, pretty bends easily. I feel like it's a bit loose. Now they're both about the same. I think it's just, the legs are just kind of a bit stiff, which is nice. Another kick. Oh, look at that. She's standing like, just, just like that. Pretty well. Great. Now let's put on the unmasked head. Or actually, masked head, not unmasked. Sorry. Uh, kind of warning here. Uh, make sure to have this straight, because I'm worried this is going to, like, because I'm trying to put it on the head right now, and it just goes back like that and um, just make sure to stop and do that because you know the more you press it down it's probably just gonna snap this off right after uh finally just getting the head right she finally has it on a little pose I and mean, it's not shooting a web out but you get the idea that you just need to change the hands but yeah there we go it's more better get her in a shooting pose also uh forgot to mention her head became a bit loose it feels lo it's on there good like peg the head's on there and make sure to press it down and all of a sudden it feels loose which is, I don't know if it was like that, I'm not sure. Yeah, her mast had a lot more like stiff. Well, I mean, you can't barely kind of move her head anyways because due to the hood of like her uh, mask. It's a great figure though, it's, the colors are awesome. You know, if you like her and like her timeline, you can get this figure and pick it up. And there's gonna be more figures coming, so if you wanna see more, hit the like button and you'll hit the subscribe button down there somewhere. I think that's where it knows. But yeah, the subscribe button down there and I will see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.